Well, hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going over literally everything that I own from Lululemon. It's a lot of stuff, so let's get into it. First things first, we're gonna talk about sizing for a second. I'm either between a size six to a 10. Normally always a size eight, but there's a few things that, you know, I either go up in size or down in size, but we'll get into that. I did wanna say that I will have my measurements in the description below and links to the products as well. This is the new Lou bodysuit. Okay, this bodysuit makes me feel some type of way. I really do like it. I get this in a size medium. Um, this is what it looks like. There's no built-in bra, which I kind of don't like about it, but I do think if you get a size that's tight enough, you don't really need to wear one, depending on like, your breast size, so yeah, I do like this. I'm gonna get it in other colors because it just makes me feel good, you know? It makes me feel good. And then I'm wearing it with, I don't know if you can tell, the scuba joggers. These are not the relaxed fit, so they're a little bit tighter at the bottom. Um, I will say I'm not a huge fan of the scuba joggers, especially if you get the darker colors because they do fade. And I actually replaced these with an old pair that I had and I just feel like quality has gone down just a little bit, which kind of upsets me, <laughs> but um, yeah, I don't know. Would I repurchase the scuba joggers? No, but I do like them because they're really good for like a travel day. If I'm in the airport, I can wear these and I can feel a little bit more put together. I'm not wearing jeans or anything like that, but I'm not wearing like full on sweatpants cause they're a little bit more tapered. All right, next up we have the Leica Cloud long line bra. I am a long line bra girly. I don't really like any other kind of bra. Um, and I do get this in a size 10. I could probably go down to a size eight, but I feel like it gets a little bit tight like where your armpits are, but it has double straps here. And then I can show you what the back looks like. So it does crisscross. I think it's pretty cute. I wear this to F45 um, on like the strength training days. So I do like it. It's not the most supportive. It And it's not supposed to be. It's supposed to be like light support but it's so freaking soft and it makes you feel like you're not wearing anything. Next, we have the All Yours Crop Tee. She's cute. I like to throw this on on cardio days where I wanna feel a little bit more covered up, but it's so breathable. I will say they used to have it in a different fabric. So if you got this a couple years ago, it was way more thin, but now it's like a thicker material. Um, I do have the older one that I can show you and I get this in a size 10 because I like it a little bit more oversized. It's oversized and boxy anyways, but I like going up in a size because I feel like the length is a little bit longer. So, but it's perfect to wear with high-waisted leggings, high-waisted shorts, or even like these joggers here. Okay. Next we have the Longline Energy Bra. This is like a medium support bra. I do stay true to size and get this in a size eight. Um, I think that you could size up as well. Like I could do a size 10 and it could fit fine as well. It does come with removable cup pads and then I'm wearing it with the A-Line pants in 25 inch and 5'3 and it like comes down right before my ankle. Um, you know, a lot of people size down in the lines. I don't, I like it more roomy. Um, but also I want to show you the back of the long line sports bra. But yeah, I will say I don't work out in the aligned pants, like as far as doing um, anything that's gonna have a lot of friction, like if I'm doing hit training or anything like that. I normally just wear it like casually, like coming out to dinner and stuff like that, running errands and just like chilling. But I mean, I can wear them to like a strength training class and I haven't had any pilling, but you do have to be careful because the material is super soft. Okay, we have the scuba, you know, this is such a classic. Um, it's, I don't know if this is a half zip or a quarter zip, but it's just, you know, just a little pullover. This one, 
doesn't have a hood or anything like that. This is the funnel neck version. I never really have it all the way up, like all the way zipped up. And I do get this one in a size medium large. Um, I will say I do have the hooded version. I always size up in the hooded version. You'll see that next because the hood is super heavy. So I do gravitate towards the one, the funnel neck without the hood because it's not gonna pull up like around your neck and like choke you out, which you know I have had issues with the hooded one about that. And here is the hooded version of the scuba. Here it is with the hood. The hood is like super big, super heavy. So I do size up, like I said, because it just gives me more space here and it doesn't pull up as much because you might get the issue of sizing down. It like pulls up near your neck because the hood is like so heavy, but I do like it. I do feel like <laughs> maybe it's just me being messy, but I feel like I've definitely stained this one. I don't know if you can see, but there's like little like watermarks on this. Now, I don't know if that's a me problem or if other people have experienced that. I know the soft stream fabric stains a lot, but yeah, I don't know. I've been having issues lately <laughs> with staining and stuff like that, but yeah. I am like a super messy eater and I don't know if I was like cooking and like oil splashed up and that's why the stain doesn't come out, but yeah, I don't know. Something to think about could be an issue. Okay, this is normally like my go-to workout outfit. These are the Align shorts. I am normally not a biker short person, but I started wearing these. These are the six inch Align shorts and they're amazing. I wear these for cardio days and it's just like, the movement I get in these, they're just very flexible. We actually have a visitor here. Hi. Oh, come here. Oh, what a good girl. Lines with the swiftly cropped long sleeve. So this is the crop length. It's not the race length. The full length, which I think is just way too long, at least for my body type. I'm 5'3", and I guess my torso is pretty short. The race length is pretty good too, but still, I still get extra fabric. Um... I just think it's still a little bit long. And then this is the race length. So it hits like right where the high rise shorts like fall. And I think it's perfect. So I have <laughs> this shirt in probably like five colors. So you can see the detail. I just think it's super flattering um, and super breathable. Like I never get sweat stains or anything like that. So, okay. Next we have the Rulu Run little zip up here this is in black i did have a heathered version which was like super thick now i don't know if it's all heathered versions or thicker than this one this one's this material is like pretty thin like if i stretch it you can see like how thin it is um which i like i like it more breathable um and the heathered version was just a little bit too thick for me so i did just posh mark that and saw that one off but this is just such a good basic for running. Um, it does have like thumb holes and a cuffed sleeve. So you can like, <laughs> I don't know if this is for like cold weather or what, but yeah. Um, this is what this looks like. So yeah, this one's cute and like, yeah. Next we have the Wonder Train High Neck Crop. This material is like more of like a slick material. So more like um, sweat wicking for sure. It does have a built-in bra with removable cup pads and the back just kind of looks like this. I don't always gravitate towards this one specifically, um, which I don't know why, because now I have it on and I'm like, this is like very supportive and I should wear it <laughs> more often. So yeah. This is the Wonder Train. This is the only thing that I have of Wonder Train. I have gone into the store and like tried on my leggings, but I just don't love the way that they like fit and feel. So, but this little tank is cute. It does have like some detailing here um, to kind of like snatch your waist in. So I think it is super flattering. Okay, 
This is the Align ribbed one shoulder tank. I don't know if you can see like the detailing, but it is ribbed and it is cropped. So I love everything that's cropped. Like if it's cropped, it's me. Like I like it and I'm <laughs> gonna buy it probably, but I do like the color. I got this on sale. Um, this is like the one shoulder detailing that you can see in the back. It's not super supportive. Like I would not wear this on cardio days at all. I have worn it um, for strength training days and just to be super safe, I do put some like fabric tape on the one side that doesn't have a strap, but I get so many compliments when I wear this. So again, probably not great if you have like a larger chest, um, but yeah. I think it's super cute, um, breathable, and like I said, like, so many people compliment me when I wear this. It's just like, such a good piece. All right, next we have the Align One Shoulder Long Line Bra. Um, so this is kind of a thicker material. It is double lined and it does have removable cup pads. Um, this is what the back looks like and I don't always gravitate towards wearing this one either because I don't know, one stretch just make me nervous. <laughs> like even if I know it's not gonna come down or if I put fabric tape, it just kinda like, I don't feel super comfortable in it all the time. So it really depends on what workout I'm doing. Um, but it is cute, it's cute with the shorts. It's cute with like the leggings as well. Um, and again, I love the long line. It comes down pretty far. So like you're not showing too much of your stomach. Um, but again, it's kind of <laughs> light support. This is the AB cup version. Um, and I believe I get it in a size eight. Um, yeah. So I do stick true to size on this one. Okay, I'm getting my purple moment in right now. But this is, again, the all yours crop tee that I showed earlier. And then these are the fast and free shorts. These have both an underwear and you can tighten them in the waistband. They do have like a string that you can tighten them, but like these sides, I wear these when I'm like walking my dog in the park. I probably wouldn't wear these to a gym class. I probably wouldn't wear them to the gym because like it's just not connected up here at the top. So then you start to see the built-in underwear and sometimes like my thighs just like eat my shorts and it like gathers in the front. Um, so not the most flattering fit, but they're so dang comfy and just like lightweight and perfect for summer. So again, like I'm wearing these on a very light walk. <laughs> That's what I'm doing in these. I have ran in them before, but again, it's like, I don't wanna have to worry about like me showing my entire thigh. Like I just want to be comfortable when I'm running. These are more like, I'm looking cute. I'm just like going <laughs> for a walk in the park. So. This is also the all yours crop tee, but this is the older version that's like super thin. Again, like look, you can see like right through the dirt. Um, but I don't think they sell it anymore. It's like the Vanessa fabric. I don't know, it starts with a V. But um, these are the hotty hot high rise short in four inches. And I don't, always gravitate towards these. They are cute and like a little bit more form fitting than the track that short that I'm gonna show you. But I always go for the track that short over these because of the length and like how they lay when I'm running. But we'll get into it. These are such a good short though if you're just like working out, if you are running and you don't care about having five inches and four inches works for you, then this would just be a great option. All right, these are the high rise track that short in five inches. I swear by these, these are like what got me through half marathon training. These are the best freaking shorts you can get. Forget Nike, forget Under Armour, forget like any other shorts at Lululemon. Like these are the best shorts that you can get to run in. They're so long that like, but like not where it's like you look like a grandma. <laughs> um, they're just like the perfect length to wear. You're still feeling cute but you're not gonna get any freaking shaping when you're running. Um, so these are what these look like. And I swear I have these in like 20 colors. And lastly, we have the all yours ribbed 
long sleeve. I don't know if this is considered a cropped version, but it is definitely cropped. Like it comes over your belly button or above your belly button. It has like the like cutest details. I don't know if you can see, but it's like ruched like right here on the side. I just think it's like super flattering. Like it's just so flattering. It's so comfortable. It is like a thicker material, but I've never had like an issue with it even wearing it on a cardio day because I just feel like it wicks sweat like really well. So this is like one of my new favorites. All right, that's all I have for you guys today. If I forgot to mention the sizing, I will have it in the description next to each of the items in order that I showed them in this video. So just check the description box if you're wondering about any sizing or anything like that. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you wanna see more videos like this, just let me know down in the comments below. And don't forget to like this video and I'll see you in the next one.